Hey guys, and welcome back to Alone in the Dark. When we last left off, I'm pretty sure we unlocked Richard's tomb. We did, apparently. And there's some gribblies in here. Uh, right, let's split these things. And hopefully that's going to be a little bit better. Right, who's this dead mofo over here? Definitely something over there. Right. Richard Morton shut me in here. A curse on him and all his family. I'm going to die here and I'm afraid. Ooh. That's Gibson. Okay. Oh, shit. Oh, it's one of you things. Get out of here. Seriously? Fuck right off. Oh, God, they're everywhere. Bollocks. Well, I don't know if there's anything back there that we can do. Try and shine these things. On the other side of this wall is a boss bottomless precipice. Well, let's not jump down there, then. Let's keep going. Ooh. Uh. What? Well, this is curious. Do we want to take these monsters out? Well, maybe. Oh man, there! I forgot these things are tough. Well, they're not that tough. I mean, they're, don't get me wrong, they're tough enough. Oh my god, they really are. I want to explore this area. Oh my god. Come on, you fucking ugly bastard. There we go. Right, I want to explore this area. <clears throat> so, that apparently leads... To nothing. All right, let's have a little look inside. Any goodies here? <sighs> so Gibson, yeah, he was one of the founders, wasn't he? In fact, let's have a look. Yeah. Taken half of the locket I found around the neck of the creature I shot in the library. She does not believe Obed could be my father. I must find out. Okay. Well, somebody's your father. I don't know if it's Obed. I wonder if there's like a secret third member or something. Um... Okay, so there's nothing in here. Oof, I mean, he's been dead a little while. Ah. So, Richard Morton. Damn, what a miserable way to die. He's actually chained up as well. Now, I forget which one was Richard. There's kind of, you know, there's a lot to this. Uh, insult it. Richard Morton. Right, so yeah, Richard Morton was the one that set up the oil company, wasn't he? Yeah, so Richard Morton is like the OG. He's the one that started building the family fortune. Okay. So, where are we going here then? Uh, yeah, we don't really want to jump into a bottomless precipice. That could be bad. But... I don't think we can light that light either. Alright, let's see if there's anything else out here. There has to be something. 
Oh. Do you want to go over to the outcrop? Uh, yes. Oh. <sighs> okay. Well, now. Press the open button. Oh, God, I remember those. These, um, now. So, if we save that case, it fucks anything up. Change disk. Oh man, that 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 just works, doesn't it? That just works really bloody well. Gate is locked. Oh fuck! Is that not the gate that we just came from? Let's not worry about that now, anyway. Okay. So yeah, so we just came from there. We're in the forest. All right, let's just get through here as quickly as possible. Ah, uh, bloody dogs. Oh. Oh, God. I guess there's nothing there we can do. All right. Let's go further into this fucking rat's nest. There's two ways to go, I guess. I'm wondering if one way... Ah, the dog's stuck. Uh, one way has items? Nope. I guess not. Yeah, the dog's totally jibbed out, which is fine. Right, through the gate. Though that gate doesn't really look like it's going to hold any dogs back. Um, just being real with you. Okay. So here we are in the fort. The old fort. Oh, man. That is a really nice, easy way of changing discs. I like that. A bit of a pain to change discs on the uh, other emulators that I've used. Not quite as seamless as you would think, but that that just well, that just worked very quickly too. <clears throat> this is a nice little scene, isn't it, with the moon up there? All right. So this is, so there's only two areas. Oh, no, there is, technically there's three areas, isn't there? Because there's a gate. Or is the gate in the fort? Uh, I'm not sure. Right, so obviously we've got to go through there, but have a little look around for items. Any items? Oh. Hey, not bad. Not bad. Back up to 114. Sweet. Because this shotgun, this shotgun really does go through its cartridges at a frightening rate. I'm going to turn. Oh, the, I don't like the music of this game. It's really shrill. The door is, lo door is locked? Uh... That next to the door. Um, I think I can climb. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we better climb the rampart then. Yeah, this shotgun as well uh, is really not cool. I thought it would be quite a cool little weapon, you know. Three-barreled shotgun. You remember the Hydra from Resident Evil? That thing's a beast. This... Uh... Considering you're unloading uh, three shotgun cartridges into something's face at point blank, it's not great. I think that's fair to say. In fact, I think that's quite the understatement. It's really not a good weapon. But then, you know, I mean, it. I suppose... If I had to play... Ooh. Devil's Advocate. Oh, hello. It is... Essentially the game's pistol. When you think that you really just straight up don't get a lot of ammo for it. 
Um, don't get a lot of ammo. I mean, don't get a lot of ammo for the actual pistol. Like, seriously. Uh, we found, what, two? Maybe three boxes of cartridges for the other gun. Um, which is, you know, literally nothing. Door is locked. Well, that's us. Also, these scenes aren't quite as impressive, but that's a nice little shadow effect, though. I mean, it's painted on shadow, no doubt, but it's still a nice effect. Okay. This is a pretty cool fort. Uh, I keep forgetting we can walk with the weapon drawn. Which I'm pretty sure I've already said is a really... Hey, we've unlocked it. Nice. That's the way in, isn't it? Yes? Question mark. Okay. I do like the fact we can walk with a shotgun out. That's actually a really refreshing change from Resident Evil. Sounds like we've got like a flying enemy. Is that a thing? Do we get flying enemies? I'm going to say no. Okay. Let's be careful. Nothing here. Right, slow and steady. Very slow and steady. Ooh, something on the floor in front of us, I think. Yeah. What is that? Uh, okay. Depth perception. Oh, it's a medkit. Depth perception is a bit of an issue. Only one FA kit, but that's fine. We actually really could use that. That brings us back up to okay, which is good. All right. Ah, there's the gribbly. Right down there in the corner. Two griblies. Not quite sure what type of griblies they are, but I'm sure they're going to introduce themselves. Okay, it looks like those four legged things. That's fine. Oh! Some uh, ammo up there. How do we get that? Ah, oh, nice! Uh, thank you. Now. Can we... Oh, we can. But do we want to? Oh, can we get, like, a decent camera angle here? Uh, it doesn't appear that we can actually, ch like, aim down at those things. That's kind of a pain. You would have thought you'd be able to. Okay. Well, at least we've got some shells. Now, let's actually check the map quickly. Okay. So, oh, Christ. Something just happened. Let's keep going this way. I'm guessing we can also go the other way as well. Ooh, items. The chest is held tightly shut by a chain. Can we not shoot it? Held tightly shut by a chain. What items do we have? Nothing that we can realistically break a chain with. That's for sure. Nothing through here. Ooh! Huh. I said. 
But I guess there was something there. Door's locked. Fucking saw that coming. Okay. Okay. Well, I guess we seem to know where we're going then, don't we? Up and over. We've got some grenades. In fact, thinking about it. Uh... Yeah, you can't even aim down at those things. That's... Wait, did they just hit me? Yeah, they're hitting me. So... I can't aim at them. No, I can't aim at them. They can aim at me. That's a bit lame, Chief. So how do I get down? Surely I can get down, right? I can. Okay, you just have to be in the right pixel as usual. Okay, that's kind of shitty. That's a really shitty little bit. Ooh. Oh, we got zombies. We can handle zombies. Get the fuck out of here, sir. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. So, now we've got a few doors to choose from. Okay. Now, is the game going to keep the ammo coming? I hope so. Unlock. Oh, right. So, this is... No? Who are you? I imagine you've come for me. Oh. You can tell, Lamb, that the writing tablets are of no use to me. Alan already knows the translation, and that it takes all the cards in hand. The gate is about to open, and the darkness to pour over the earth. The creatures will indulge a massacre that even all the armies of the world could never stop. Nothing can save us from the darkness now. You too should prepare to die. Night is falling all over the world. It has slipped its cold hand into my brain. Stop! Stop! I only want to find out if you knew Mary Fedrin. Fedrin? That's... The name reminds me of a long-gone past. But I want nothing to do with Mary. Stop it from getting to my eyes. Mary Fedrin. Mary. <sighs> my blood is curdling. I feel my bones snapping like a block of wood in my skull. Are you sure you never knew Mary Fedrin? <laughs> Are you sure you're not my father? <laughs> Me? Your father? <laughs> <laughs> a daughter? I don't know who put that foolish idea in your mind. But let me tell you, that is simply impossible. So now, let me gather myself. I wish to ready myself for the judgment. When one bears the fruit with an sinner's eyes on it, one must get ready before the darkness. But I can see you. Well, that was a load of old nonsense, wasn't it? Alright, well, Oban, you're either going to be a part of the solution, my boy, or you're going to be part of the problem. Ooh. Oh, there's two items there. Ah, black metallic card. And a charm of saving. Well, there. Uh, uh, um. Is that meant to happen? Where the fuck did he go? Uh. I'm going to assume that he's meant to still be there? Nope. Okay. He literally disappeared. Cool. Guessing that totally was not actually meant to be happening. I don't know. 
But either way, he's gone. Now, let's see what we can do to stop this horrible darkness. Oh! The fuck? Okay, that was actually really fucking cool. That was really cool. Um, okay. Oh. See, look, now... Now we... Don't have a marker on the map where we are. Now we do. What's that about? Is it a bug? I don't know, man. Ooh. Right, door seems to be locked by a complex mechanism. I'm guessing... Black metallic plate. Looks like a perforated card for the... The first computers, yeah. I do not have enough cards to activate the mechanism. Alright, cool. So we can't just put one in. Alright. Let's explore this place. Place looks like a pretty bizarre fort, to say the least. That's putting it lightly. Right, now do we? No. So we just straight up do not appear. Anywhere. Okay. Weird. Weird. These camera angles do not make it easy to navigate. Ooh. Box of rockets. Very nice. Gives us 20. Alright, just what the doctor ordered. Never have too many rockets. Oh, stuff. That. Oh, I was going to say, is that a new weapon? But no, it's wire cutters. If this was Resident Evil. Ah, yes. <laughs> wire cutters. Oh, no, it's bolt cutters in Resident Evil. Like, uh, seriously. Every. Uh, I think the last three Resident Evil games have had bolt cutters. The same bolt cutters. I have at last perfected the perforator. I have never found the path my father took to the gate to the world of darkness, but I know from the directions he left me that an underground gallery exists, which passes close to the fort's um, ob obliettes. I will be able to excavate a tunnel through the granite to the gallery with the perforator. The Akansas stone grandpa left me is the heart of the device. It can store and reconstitute light energy with remarkable efficiency. My first tests are conclusive. If I manage to excavate six feet of rock face in a few minutes. Oh, I managed to excavate six feet of rock face in a few minutes. But the perforator has one abiding weakness. The barrel exhibits an un an infuriating tendency to disintegrate under the intense temperature created. I need to cast this element in a single block. Hmm. The extraordinary properties of the Akan, uh, Akanbis stone led me to imagine harnessing the fearsome power of lightning as an energy source. Victory! I have at last connected with the underground galleries. And I have found the gate. Not a moment too soon either. The excavation, which lasted several hours, seems to have worn out the canvas stone. What's more, the barrel split along its length and is now useless. Sounds like some kind of... yeah, weapon. Uh... Guess that's like how to make it? And make this weapon? Interesting. Is 
metallic piece. Oh shit. Do we have to make a weapon? Do we have to make a gun? I don't know, Chief. Kinda can't wait to find out, though. Right, get fucked. We got plenty of cartridges. Got loads of grenades. Got more grenades than anything else, really. So, tripod support. Tripod support made from two pieces. All right, cool. So we've got the bolt cutters, which I'm guessing we need to go back and use. Oh, ah. So a lot of these stones of saving or things of saving, they're kind of all over the place. Let's kind of have a good little look around here though. Oh, yeah. Say so it looks like stuff everywhere. Box of cartridges, very nice. Brings up to 141 shells. Not including what's in the weapon. Good amount of gear here. We have a hell of a lot of ammo. And it's not really like we've been saving it, but I mean, I guess, well, we've just started this too. So I'm not 100% sure how much is left exactly, but right. So we can go through here, but must be the blocked up passage. Right, so I'm guessing we need to unblock that with the weapon thing that we've got to build now that's got to be oh med packs it all seems sealed up okay the door is sealed up but i guess we're not going back there then all right let's go back upstairs see if we can open up that box I mean, we have an item, part of a weapon, I guess. Seems fairly obvious that, it, you know, it's going to be some kind of... Well, I don't know, though, because we've got a rocket launcher. Are we going to get a more powerful weapon? Something bigger than the rocket launcher? With unlimited ammo? Hmm. It's happened before. It has happened before. Resident Evil Dead Aim comes to mind. Right, so that's the card reading machine that we can't use. Uh, is this the way out? Oh, it actually was. You know what? Let's kill these things. These things suck. And yeah, it's a lot of ammo, but these things suck. I hate these things. I hate these things more than I probably should. And they are frustratingly strong as well. Okay, nothing else here. Considering you only get three shots with this weapon, I really wish there was a faster way of reloading it. Yeah, nothing else there. Okay. I'm going to go out on a limb and say there's probably an awful lot of pieces to find for this contraption. Uh, which, funny enough, Leads me to wonder about finding all the statues. Unless all the statues are just like piled up somewhere together. 
Cut the chain. Large ornate rusty key. Ah, and a steel ingot as well. Okay, so we need to smelt the steel ingot. Door is locked. Can we use the key? Come on. No, so we can't use the key there. Right, where else were there locked doors? So, uh, I guess we're going to go back down then. Yeah, there was a locked door. But it looked like it was bolted shut though. So, let's have a look. Let's have a little squeeze, shall we? Definitely looking forward to... Seeing what's going on here now. Oh, that's steel. Steel ingot. That Swiss Bank Corporation. So whatever it is, we're making it out of steel. Unless we're going to mix some more metals together. Which is possible. Right, so the only other locked door there was, was down here. Uh, see if we're going to bump into any monsters on the way. I still don't understand why sometimes we can see ourselves on the map and sometimes we can't. Was that a monster shadow? No, it was our shadow. We have two shadows apparently. Okay. Right. Now let's... I kind of want to have a quick squiz around here. Uh, don't want to miss anything. I mean, we found rockets. Found shotgun shells. And again, funny, still no extra handgun bullets. Which really is quite bizarre, if you ask me. I'm guessing when we play as Cedric. Is it Cedric? I can't remember his name now. I'm guessing... Oh, the door's sealed up. So we can't use the key there. Uh. Oh, right. My bad. Must be the blocked up passage. Right. So it says wherever it is, it's not in the oubliette. Service well. Okay, well, we're out of time here, guys. So I guess I'm going to have to have a little look around and find out where we need to go. But I will do that in between the next video. So thank you very much for watching, guys. And as always, till next time.